So here's the ultimate big picture, Matthew 13, 31 through 33. No, the creator of the universe agreed to the Shamo of Aya. So now you know, if you didn't know. You name your child or B'nai Aya, and you'll see what happens. So let's describe what we're talking about in Matthew 13, 31 through 33. You have a mustard seed. A mustard seed is small and is so small and so is the plant and it's harvested every season. When you have a tree, so you're going from a mustard seed from a plant that's harvested every season to becoming a tree. That means that the plant would be growing wide and tall and it wouldn't be cut down. It would avoid being cut down, and it would have strong branches to hold the birds. The possible human metaphor is somebody whose child goes from being short or a midget to becoming a very tall person with a large family that can house messengers from other families, because that's what birds do. They migrate to various areas. That is my interpretation and the ultimate big picture of Matthew thirteen thirty one through 33. Though something may be so small, it eventually becomes a gigantic tree.